Alright. So now we're going to head off to Crystal Islands. The last of the regular stages, not counting the Sparks mission in the game. So, let's go. So what you making, by the way? Huh? What you making? Oh, uh, Photoshop? Yeah. I am making logo stuff for the store floor, because they asked me to do things. It's basically something for, like, a few of the shows they're planning to do. Okay. Yeah. Because I am partially the graphic design dude, because it's... No one else fucking does it. And we gotta make a bloody show where I show those mods. I don't know how I wanna do that. I'm sure you'll find a way. Death to Zergs. I've not actually seen Fairy Tale. My uh, friend. Mine is the big bad wolf. It's all about Little Red Riding Hood. Some of grandma. Hoodwinks? Yes. How did I know you were thinking of that? I actually kind of liked Hoodwinked. I kind of did too. It has a certain charm to it. Two is not good. I never even bothered with two. Two doesn't have the same charm because it doesn't have that awkward CD that kind of like made it how it is. It's like slight. It's, it, it tries to be better. And because of that, I think it fails. I, to me. Does that make sense? Yeah. Uh, Honestly, Hoodwink won, like, I actually kind of like the plot. Yeah. And the weird CG just sort of... It was it's campy. Kind of, it, yeah. Because CG around that time was, was pretty good, right? It was decent. It wasn't a Hoodwink level. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know, I guess, like, the plot, like, how everything was, like, stylized and, like, all the acting characters, like, it made its own little thing. And some of the jokes were pretty funny. Yeah. I actually liked the turtle one when the act man's, uh, chopping down all the trees. The turtle just go, RUN! <laughs> <laughs> they just go so trip? slow. Uh... <laughs> This bear is trying to body slam me. I don't know how I appreciate that. This crystal bear. Apparently, Death to Zergs will reach through the internet and slap both of us. Right, so our first egg is Manny. We have 140 eggs. We have nine left to go. Then we unlock Supra. Bonus work. I need to go and see the Lego Batman. Oh, you want to see the trick I need to see it too. I love that the fact that it's literally because I'm Batman has become a character. I'm, I'm glad. I'm glad it is. I'm kind of glad it is too. All this magic is just misdirection, you know. Which is why I'm going to start that whirlwind over there. Abra Kadabra. I didn't want to talk to you. I wanted to get gems. I just got body slammed by a bear. Nice. You did? No. Don't worry, my magical dragonfly protected me. 
who in the Legend of Spyro series, all I know is that apparently he is Spyro's brother. What? Adopted. What? I don't know much about the Legend of Spyro series. It was like Why one not? of the. Because I never played them. Spyro. Spyro. Enter the Dragon Fly burned me on many ways. <laughs> like how many people thought that Sonic was pretty much dead after 06. That's how I was after playing that game. Oh. And I 100%ed it. And got nothing. But a horrible time and a massive migraine. <laughs> from the frame rate. Okay, I'll show you again. If you watch carefully, maybe you'll be able to see how it's done. Abracadabra! Speaking of bears, we've got body slammed by one again, and here's the last money bags encounter that we have to pay him in the game. 20 left minutes left until 2-9. Body slam him? No. Sadly. So, let's talk to Moneybags. Spyro, did you know I happen to be a very talented amateur magician? My specialty is the, uh, amazing extending bridge trick. I'd love to show you, but I need a small donation first. For my expenses, you understand. So okay, you get sleepy. I bet. I have to pay a thousand gems to cross this bridge. Extortion. That's what he is. Yes, that's what he is. How dare you? So I'm happy over here. You shouldn't anger a magician, Spyro. Can't glide over. I just no. might decide to turn you into a blue hedgehog or something. Oh my God! They referenced Sonic. What? What's up? You shouldn't anger a magician, Spyro. I just might turn you into a blue hedgehog or something. Wow, that's... It's not even subtle. I know. Spyro, did you know... Plus, this was also when... Uh, this came out in 2000, so this is a year before Adventure, 1, Adventure 2, so... Maybe they were making fun of the fact that Sega was pretty much going... Becoming a financial flop in the console market. Damn. Savage. I know, right? I love Spyro's response to this. Not again. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. It's par for the course now. Hocus pocus ziggledy zen. Make this bridge get long again. I also love his spell. Because everyone in this world will do like a magical spell like abracadabra, alakazam, or some magic words. Here's money bags. Hocus pocus ziggity zen, make this bridge get long again. <sighs> what? You have to love money bags. He's pretty good. He's pretty good at his job, which is extorting money out of you. All right. I'm afraid the show's over, Spyro. Why don't you go play with the gnomes? I think they look lonely. Wow, what an asshole. Well, what happened? I talk you can talk to Moneybags again and as long as you haven't gone into a new area because it'll despawn Moneybags after you pay him. Talk to him again, he goes, I'm afraid the show's over, Sparrow. Why don't you go play with the gnomes? I think they look lonely. Uh, damn. Like in his What's your, what's your deal? <laughs> I'm gonna die. Unless I kill a turtle. Take money back. Found a turtle to kill. Why, why are you killing turtles? Because they give me my magical dragonfly and the butterfly. This game is for kids. No, it's not. It's like Kirby. Kirby has. Kirby's. No. The Kirby, deepest video, floor. Video games are for kids. Kids shouldn't play video games. They should be outside, like, 
uh, you know, what do kids do nowadays? Uh, tossing a hoop. Sticking a hoop. That's what kids back in my day used to play. Killing flying beavers. Okay, what the fuck is going on? You can't, you can't keep, like, saying that. Because now i got to, like, figure out where the stream is and, like, what the fuck the heck is that? Why the flying beavers? Uh, the person at the beginning of the level will tell you that, uh, the sor- They were- they were practicing magic to rival the sorceress and it didn't go well. I could tell! They accidentally turned bears into crystallized bears, trees came alive and want to attack you, and flying beavers. Oh, okay, I lost signal to my Elgato again. Okay, then. That's it. That's kinda weird. Like, I lost full signal to the Elgato. Which means my HDMI cord probably is plugged in on. And I gotta do the frame rate thing again. Normally I just have to do it once per stream, but I guess in this case. I still can't believe it's already time almost time for Jack. Season five. Uh, well, I, I suppose Jack. I could show you my new trick. As long as you promise not to tell the great Zamboni, he steals all my best work. Alakazam! Um, I hate to tell you this, Mr. Magician. The great Zamboni already ended up stealing this trick. Here, you can have this. I was going to use it in a trick, but my magic just keeps bouncing off. And we obtain Lloyd. There we go. 141. We are almost done with all the levels. I can't believe how far we've come. Right. Uh, Death to Zergs, you can go and watch Fairy Tale if you want. I mean, this is going up on YouTube later. I love how I tell my people, you don't have to stay for my streams. <laughs> Most streamers would go, please stay for my streams. I need your viewership, please! Time to kill a... Alright, time to kill a flying thief! Got him. I saved Max. Now I'm gonna go and play Whack-A-Mole.